One of the most common questions I get asked is how to tell the difference between allergies, the common cold, and COVID-19, and when to seek care with an allergist immunologist. Seasonal allergies, COVID-19, and the common cold can all cause some overlapping symptoms. The immune system is activated in all three cases, and it's this activation that leads to symptoms. Nasal congestion and increased mucus production are almost always present when someone contracts COVID-19, the common cold, or suffers from allergies. And it's this congestion that can lead to cough in all three cases. So it may be tricky to determine what you might be suffering from. However, there are telltale signs that indicate someone is fighting a pathogen, such as COVID-19, or a common cold virus, rather than having an allergic reaction. There are different branches of the immune system, and generally speaking, different parts of the immune system are activated to fend off different invaders. And this is what leads to the differences. The big differences are that only allergies will cause itching of the nose, throat, and eyes with sneezing. In addition, seasonal allergies last the entire season. Allergies will never lead to a fever or chills. Fever, fatigue, muscle aches, sore throat, and headaches will only be present when the body is fighting off an infection. When we have an infection, symptoms come on suddenly, run their course, and resolve. When trying to differentiate a cold from COVID-19, things get a little bit tricky. Common colds in COVID-19 can present almost identically in some cases. Fever, fatigue, muscle ache, sore throat, headache, cough, shortness of breath, sneezing and congestion can be caused by a cold or COVID-19. Based on probability, colds are less likely to cause fever and shortness of breath and are more likely to result in sneezing, whereas COVID is more likely to cause fever difficulty breathing, and diarrhea. COVID is also much more likely to lead to a loss of smell or taste as opposed to cold viruses. As COVID has evolved, so have the symptoms. Fortunately, the virus has lost some affinity for the lungs and is less likely to cause pneumonia than the initial variants. The symptoms have become more similar to cold viruses. No one symptom can reliably distinguish one from the other. The best way to tell what you're suffering from is to see your doctor and get tested. A quick nasal swab can assess for COVID and lots of other viruses. Alternatively, if you notice your symptoms are longer and are interested in seeing if you have allergies, it might be best to get an allergy skin test with an allergist. Be sure to schedule a visit with your doctor to determine whether you're dealing with allergies, a cold, or COVID-19. They can guide you with the right testing and next steps to help manage your symptoms. Thanks for listening and take care.